Annamaya, Pranamaya, Manomaya, Vignanamaya, Anandamaya, Me Shudhyantan, Jyotiraham, Tirajavi Papma, Bhuyasagush, Swaha. Ah, may all parts of us be filled with light and vitality. May our muscles and joints be filled with vitality, our nervous system, our mind, our personality, and our spirit. May all parts of us be filled with light and vitality. Thank you. Thank you once again for joining me for my morning Vini Yoga practice on this somewhat rainy morning here in Laguna Beach. It's kind of cold outside. My little toe nuggets are quite frozen. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to this nice uh, yoga practice together. We'll start with a little bit of breathing. After we complete the breathing part, we'll come onto our hands and knees and we'll look to move the body in a nice, even balanced way. So here we go. <clears throat> Excuse me, got all choked up there for a second. <laughs> you can hear my metronome clicking. It's making one click a second. We'll practice some seven second long breaths and some eight second long breaths before we move. So please sit upright, relax your shoulders, bring your lips together. Begin to pay attention to the tip of your nose and begin to feel your own breath. Notice when you inhale, you can sense air moving from the nostrils down your throat. When you exhale, you can feel air traveling back up the throat, out the nostril. Let's take a free breath in together, just a bit, breathing in. Slowly breathing out. And we'll start with seven second long breaths. Here we go. Inhaling one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. We'll pause, holding the breath in. Then we'll exhale one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Let's do that twice more. Breathing in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Again, pausing, holding the breath in. And exhale, please. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do that one more time. Breathing in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pausing, holding the breath in. Breathing out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, let's try eight seconds. Breathe in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Again, pause, holding the breath in, please. And we'll exhale one, two, feel air flowing out. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's do that two more times. Breathing in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again, we'll hold the breath in for a moment, feel your chest. And let's breathe out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's do that one more time. Breathing in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Holding the breath in, feel your chest. Exhale, please. One, two, feel air flowing out. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Good morning, good morning. Please join me. We'll start on our yoga mat on all fours on hands and knees. <clears throat> okay, let's come down onto all fours. Let's link this beautiful breathing together with some simple movements. We'll start with the Chakravakasana. Hands under the shoulders, knees under the hips, and the toes nicely pointing back and away. Here we go. Let's take a smooth breath in together now. Breathing in. Here we go. We'll bring the hips to the heels together. Let's exhale slowly. We'll move back and down. Breathing out. Oh, that feels good. Let's come back to the hands. Breathing in. Again, let's bring the hips to the heels together. Exhaling, moving back and down. Off we go. Linking our moving and breathing together. Coming back to the hands again. Breathing in.
hips to the heels, exhale, moving back and down, breathing out. Feel how the air flows out and pull in your tummy a little bit, please. Five more back to the hands, breathing in. And hips to the heels, exhaling, moving back and down, pulling in the tummy. We can begin to feel our muscles as we move and breathe. Feel your low back and hips and thighs and knees. Four more times back to the hands, inhale. Good, hips to the heels. Exhale, tummy pulls in. I can feel my low back, I can feel my shins, my feet, my little frozen toes, my shoulders. Again, back to the hands, inhale. And exhaling again, hips to the heels, back and down. Pulling in the tummy. Feels so good to feel my muscles. Let's do two more, coming floorwards again, inhale. Hips to the heels, exhale. I can feel my shoulders, my palms. One more time, let's come forwards again, inhale. And hips to the heels, exhaling back and down. Now at the end of the exhale, let's rest the hands on the low back. Let's practice Vajrasana. Bring your hands onto your low back. Now let's inhale, stand, and sweep the right arm out and up to the sky. Vajrasana. Feel your right shoulder. With our exhale, we'll fold, taking the right arm back behind us. And let's alternate arms. Inhale, standing. Let's take the left arm out and up. One smooth breath. Feel your left shoulder, left arm. Exhale, we'll fold, bringing the left arm back behind us. I can already feel my neck and shoulder muscles. Let's do right arm again. Inhale, right arm up. Good, we'll sweep the right arm back and fold and look left as we come down. And we'll alternate. Inhale, standing left arm up. We'll turn our head center. And we'll sweep and fold the left arm back, fold and look to the right. Awesome, let's try both arms up. Please join me, inhale both arms up, Vajrasana. We'll interlock our fingers, open the hands. Good morning, fingers. Exhale, we'll sweep both arms back. We'll look left as we come down. Just simple, simple, moving and breathing. One more time, inhaling, widen up. Feel that nice stretch. Let's sweep our arms and fold and look right and come down. Excellent, excellent. Let's come forwards onto the tummy. Let's say good morning to our back muscles. Let's come forwards onto the tummy. Next, we'll practice Bhujangasana. And we'll bring our arms alongside of us. We'll point the fingers towards the toes. We'll look to the right. Let's stay here for a breath. <clears throat> now, please be gentle. Bhujangasana. Let's inhale and lift the chest and head off the floor together. Inhale, lifting up. Not too high. And let's stay here. We'll exhale where we are. Chin tuck. And now let's inhale together. We'll lift up just a little bit higher. And we'll look left as we exhale and lower down. Let's do that again. Chest and head lifting. Inhale, we'll come up. Head center. Let's stay here. Exhale where we are. Hello, back muscles. Good morning. Inhaling, we'll lift a little bit higher up. And exhale, we'll look right and lower down. Very good. Pause for a breath here. Take a breath in and out. Okay, let's try Ardha Shalabhasana, left thigh and chest lifting. Let's try that chest and left thigh lifting up. And we'll stay here. Let's exhale where we are. Ardha Shalabhasana. Now let's go ahead and sweep the right arm forwards as we inhale. Bend your elbow generously, so it's like a salute. And exhale, we'll sweep the right arm back, look left, and lower everything down. Let's try the right thigh and chest lifting up. Inhale, chest and right thigh lifts up. And let's stay here, we'll exhale where we are. 
And now let's sweep the left arm forwards as we inhale, elbow bends like a salute. Feel that shoulder. Exhale, we'll sweep the left arm back and look right and lower down. Again, please just pause for breath, inhale and exhale. Let's try both legs and chest, Shalabhasana. Let's try that. Inhale, chest and both thighs lift up. Let's stay here, exhaling where we are. Let's reach both arms forwards as we inhale, both elbows bend. Exhale, we'll sweep, look left and lower down. And let's do that one more time. Just the chest and thighs, inhale, lift up. Let's stay here, exhaling where we are. We'll reach both arms forwards, inhale, elbows bend. Exhale, sweep, look right, lower down, and rest. Oh, good morning, back muscles and shoulders. Let's come back to the hands and knees again. <clears throat> now we'll practice the counter pose, Chakravakasana. Let's take a smooth breath in where we are. We'll just do three of them. And carefully exhale, move back and down. Feel your back muscles stretching a bit. Oh, that's good. Let's come back to the hands, breathing in. And hips to the heels, moving back, exhaling. And let's do that one more time. Coming back to the hands, inhaling. And then again, hips to the heels. Exhale back and down. Oh, that feels good. Now let's transition to standing. Let's come to the hands again, inhaling, chakra bakasana. Let's curl the toes and lift the knees as we exhale. Come to down dog, adho mukha shanasana. Oh, feel those legs. How about four times? Let's lift our heels up as we inhale. Exhale, let's press our heels down. Ah, oh, good morning, calves. Let's lift our heels up as we inhale, feel your toes. Exhale, heels down, feel your ankles, calves, Achilles tendons. Two more times, lifting our heels up, inhale. Heels down, exhale, feel your palms and shoulders and arms. One more time, let's lift our heels up as we inhale and press the heels down as we exhale. Oh, let's take a smooth breath in where we are. With our exhale, let's walk the hands back towards the toes. Bend your knees so it's easy, so there's no strain. And we'll simply slide our hands up the legs to standing as we inhale. And good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Beautiful. Now, next let's practice a little bit of axial extension, chest and shoulders and arms. We'll stand with our feet close together and arms at our sides. Here we go, Tadasana. Let's inhale together and raise both arms out and up to the sky. We'll interlock our fingers and open the hands. This is the perfect morning stretch, I think. Exhale, we'll bring our arms to the sides. I like that feeling of getting long. <laughs> Let's do it again. One smooth breath together. Inhale, arms up, fingers interlock, palms open. And exhale, arms back at our sides. And let's do it again. Inhale slowly, arms out and up. Nice, smooth, deep breath. Let's hold this position. Let's stay here. We'll exhale together. Here we go, here we go. Let's inhale and stretch a bit more deeply. Inhale. Oh, you gotta love that. Exhale, arms back at our sides. Pause and take a breath in and out. It's so good, chest and shoulders. Let's try Vita Bhadrasana, warrior pose. Let's start with the right foot forwards and the left foot back. Right foot forwards, left foot back. I'm gonna place my right hand on my right thigh, warrior pose. So now join me, please, won't you? Inhale, bend your right knee and raise your left arm forwards and up. Feel that for a moment. Exhale, lower your left arm, straighten your knee. You can widen, lengthen your stance. Let's do it again. Inhale, bending the right knee, raising the left arm up. Feel a nice stretch across the left side. And then exhale, lower your arm, straighten your knee. How about both arms? Please inhale, bend your right knee, take both arms up. Can you stay here? Stay here, exhale. And we'll stretch up as we inhale. 
and lower our arms and straighten the knee. Exhale. Let's do that one more time. We'll bend the right knee, raising both arms up. Inhale, nice deep breath. Let's stay here. Exhale. Feel your legs, feel your legs. Stretch your torso up. Inhale. Let's stay another breath. Stay here. Exhale. I'll bend my knee just a bit more deeply. One more time. Let's take a smooth inhale. And then we'll exhale, lower our arms, straighten the knee, and bring the feet together. Oh, that is so good. Let's try the second side. Left foot forwards, right foot back. Oh, thank you very much for practicing with me this morning. So good. Left hand, left thigh. Virabhadrasana. Now please inhale, bend your left knee, reach your right arm forwards and up. Keep your back leg straight. Maybe you can feel your right calf as well. Exhale, lower your arm, straighten your left knee. I'll widen the stance, let's do that again. Left knee bends, right arm up, inhale. Feel that stretch across the right side. And we'll come out of the pose, exhale. Moving as we breathe. Let's take both arms up. Left knee bends, both arms up, inhale. Now let's stay here, let's exhale. Now let's stretch up as we inhale, please. With our exhale, we'll lower our arms, straighten the knee one more time. Feel those beautiful muscles. Left knee bends, both arms up, inhale. Stay here, exhale, feel your thighs. Feel your muscles stretch up as you inhale. One more time, stay here, exhale. You can bend your knee just a bit more. Feel those muscles activate. Let's take one more breath in together, breathe in. And please lower your arms, straighten your knee. And we'll bring the feet together and pause. Oh, that feels so good. I love afterwards, I can breathe deeply. My chest is nice and free. Next is forward folding, Ardha Uttanasana. We'll stand with our feet close together, not too wide or too narrow. Let's start with the right arm. Let's raise the right arm up as we inhale. Exhale, just fold halfway down and bring your right arm just to your low back. Kind of feel that in your body. Can you feel that? Inhale, left stand and raise the left arm up. There's that left shoulder again. Exhale, we'll fold halfway and bring the left arm to the low back. Let's try both arms up. Inhale, standing with me, both arms up, stretch up. And again, exhale, fold halfway, bringing both hands to the low back. Feel your back and hips. Inhale, standing, both arms up again. Now let's fold a bit more deeply. Exhale, sweep your arms to your low back and fold a bit more deeply. Oh, hello, muscle. Inhale, standing, both arms up again. Let's do that one more time. Nice, smooth exhale. Let's sweep our arms and fold. I can feel my shoulders, back, hips, hamstrings, calves. Let's stand again as we inhale. Arms up. And with a smooth exhale, let's sweep the hands and bring the fingers onto the floor, all the way down. Moving with our breath. Let's keep the fingers on the floor looking forwards together. We'll inhale. Let's exhale, fold and stretch. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Two more times, let's look forwards a bit as we inhale. Exhale, fold and stretch. Tuck your chin, pull in your tummy. One more time, let's look forwards as we inhale. Tuck the chin, exhale, fold and stretch. Now keep your chin tucked down one time, inhale where you are. And now exhale, stretch a bit more deeply, not too much. Now let's raise our arms to standing. Inhale, arms out and up. We'll lower the arms to the sides as we exhale and pause. Oh, that was very, very nice. Very nice. Let's try side stretching next. Look how we're cruising along through this beautiful practice. Side stretching. Let's start with the Tandasana uh, lateral adaptation with our feet close together. Then we'll widen the base. We'll start with a narrow base. Let's go ahead and take both arms up again. Inhale, both arms up. Good morning. Let's lean the shoulders gently to the right as we exhale, just a little bit to the right. 
Now you're looking to feel the left side of your rib cage here. Then inhale, come back up. And with a smooth exhale, gently take the shoulders to the left, not too far. Feel the right side of your rib cage. Let's do that again. Inhale, back up. And exhale, shoulders to the right. Can you feel those muscles there? Inhale, please come back up. Exhale, shoulders to the left. Look at how nice that feels. Rib cage, waistline. Inhale, come back up. Good exhale, shoulders to the right. We'll hold the position for a breath. Let's stay here and breathe in. And exhale, stretch a bit more deeply. Oh, inhale, come all the way back up to center, please. Let's do the other side. Exhale, shoulders now to the left. Oh, hello, rib cage muscles. Let's stay here one time, breathing in. And exhale, stretch just a bit more. And inhale all the way back up. With our exhale, we'll lower the arms. And again, let's pause just for a breath or so here. I like that. I can feel my shoulders, my sides, even down into the waistline. Okay, so now let's widen the base. Let's take a bigger movement. Wide base, trikonasana. <clears throat> And here I'll invite us to start with the right foot turned out, perpendicular to the pelvis. Now let's open our arms like a letter T as we inhale, trikonasana. And please bend your right knee just a touch and exhale, come down to the right. Feel your hips and thighs. Oh, inhale, we'll stand up. We'll do three in a row. Look how nice that is. Exhale again, please, down to the right. Feel your adductor, hip, thigh. Inhale, stand up again, please. Now we'll come down as we exhale down to the right and stay. Trikonasana. Now the top arm, the left arm. Let's reach the left arm across, breathing in. Feel your rib cage. Exhale, please sweep the left arm behind you onto your low back. Feel your shoulder. Let's do that three times. Inhale, reaching across again. Nice straight arm. Exhale, bringing your arm back. Feel your shoulder, arm, wrist, hand, fingers. One more time, inhale, reaching across. But this time, stay here, exhale where you are. And now inhale, stretch a bit more deeply. And now exhale, we'll bring the arm back. Let's stand up as we inhale. Let's move to the second side. We'll turn the right foot in, and then we'll turn the left foot out, second side. Inhale first, please. Let's bend the left knee just a touch. Exhale down to the left. Oh, nice. Hello, legs. Inhale, standing back up. Again, exhale down to the left. Feel those hips and thighs one more time. Inhale, standing up. And exhale, let's come down to the left and stay here. Stretching the right side. Inhale with me. Take the right arm across, please. Good morning. Exhale, bring your right arm back. Feel your shoulder, neck, arm, hand. Two more times. Inhale, right arm reaching across, smooth breath. Exhale, bringing the arm back. You can feel that warmth and circulation. One more time. Inhale, reaching the right arm across, one breath. But now we'll stay. Let's stay here, exhale. Let's stretch a bit as we inhale. And please bring your right arm back on the exhale. And then we'll stand up as we breathe in. We'll bring our feet together and lower our arms. And just in case there's any tightness in the low back or sacrum, let's just do a simple forward fold just to compensate. So just a simple forward fold. So I can, I'll invite us to bring our feet close together. Let's raise both arms up again, breathing in. Let's bring the fingers to the floor as we breathe out. Let's keep the fingers on the floor. Let's look ahead of us as we inhale. Let's fold a bit as we exhale. Let's do that one more time. Let's look ahead of us as we inhale. And fold on the exhale. I can definitely feel my low back stretching, my sacrum. Can we stay here one time together, breathing in? And breathing out, gently stretching. I hope that feels nice. Let's raise our arms as we inhale. Nice deep breath, arms up. And we'll bring the arms to the sides on the exhale and pause. Very nice. Okay, we have one more direction. This will be twisting. 
And we'll again take the feet apart. So it's a nice wide base, you know, about the, the length of one leg. So it's like a nice equilateral triangle. Paribriti Trikonasana. Let's open our arms as we breathe in now. Let's take the left hand just to the floor in front of us. Exhale, please bring the left hand onto the floor right in front of you. Feel that in your body. And then inhale, we'll stand up. That's totally doable. That was nice. Exhale, please bring the right hand down to the floor. Can you feel your hips, adductor muscles? Inhale, we'll stand up. We'll do four in a row. Now, let's exhale and take the left hand just a little bit closer towards the right foot. You can look behind you towards your right hip. Oh, feel that. Inhale, come up to standing, please. Second side, that's nice. Exhale, take the right hand a little bit closer to the left foot. I can feel my hip, hamstring, my calf muscle. Inhale, standing up. We'll do two more. Round three. Exhale now, I'm gonna take my left hand even closer to the right foot. Oh yeah, inhale, coming up. Second side. Hello, legs. Exhale, right hand a bit closer to the left foot. Don't overdo it, no sharp pain. Inhale, come up. Last time. Exhale, left hand to the right side. But here, let's stay a breath. Let's stay here, inhale. And press the breath out, exhale. And we'll switch. Please, inhale, standing, second side. Oh, you like that one? Right hand to the left side, exhale. Please, feel those muscles. Let's stay here, inhale. And twist as we exhale. And we'll stand on the inhale. We'll lower the arms, bring the feet together, and pause. Oh, it's getting warm in here. Now, let's do another forward fold, but here let's see if we can feel our hips and thighs. We'll kind of activate the leg muscles a little bit. So I'll stand with my feet close together. This is Artha Utkatasana. We'll just do like three in a row, just enough to kind of, you know, build a little bit of energy in our legs. So <clears throat> with our next inhale, let's go ahead and raise both arms up again. So inhale, please join me, arms up. And here, just simply, simply. Exhale, bend your knees generously, like you're sitting in a chair. Bring your hands to the ground, duck your chin, and then simply inhale, raise your arms up. Stay here, exhale, sense your hips and thighs. As we inhale, we'll stand all the way up, and then exhale, arms at our sides. Let's do it again. Inhale, arms up, nice deep breath. Good morning. Exhale, knees bend, touching the floor. I like this part. I can feel my low back and sacrum muscles. Inhale, arms up. Good, stay there. Exhale, feel your hips and thighs. Good morning, legs. Inhale, standing all the way up. Exhale, arms at the sides. Oh yeah, one more time. Inhale, arms up, deep breath. Exhale, tummy pulls in, squatting and touching the floor. Chin tuck. Inhale, arms up. Stay here, exhale. Take your time, move slowly and feel. Inhale, up, 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 up. Exhale, rest. Oh yeah, oh, hips and thighs, that was great. That was good. Are you having fun? It's good, huh? Uh, now, let's stand at the back of the yoga mat. Forward fold, downward facing dog in Chakravakasana. Transitioning back to the floor. So let's try. Let's take both arms up again. We'll inhale. Like we did before, Uttanasana, hands to the floor, exhale. And just one time now, let's glance ahead of us as we breathe in and fold as we breathe out. Oh, that feels good. Let's stay here. Inhale where you are. And stretch just a bit as you exhale. Feel your legs. Please walk your hands ahead of you as you inhale. Come back to down dog. Adho Mukha Shanasana. And stay here. Exhale. And how about just three times? Inhale, heels up. Exhale, heels down. Feel the nice difference now. More freedom, easier to move. Inhale, heels up. Hello, toesies. 
Exhale back down to your palms and shoulders. One more time, inhale, heels up. And then exhale back down. Very good. Let's bring the knees in front of us onto the floor. Inhale back to Chakravakasana, please. And then point your toes behind you. Let's exhale, hips to the heels. Moving with our breath. Inhale, come back to the hands again, breathing in. And exhale, hips to the heels, abs in. And let's rest just for a breath or so, please. Please rest for a breath or so. Relax your fingers and wrists and arms and shoulders. Very good. Now let's stand up on the knees. So we did some uh, quad strengthening. Now let's try to stretch those quads a bit. Let's practice Ekapada Ushtrasana. So let's bring the right foot forwards in front of us. This will be kind of like the warrior pose, one foot forwards. So my left foot is nicely pointing back and away. Here I'll rest both hands on my right knee. Now let's inhale together. Let's bend the right knee and just, just gently, not too far, inhale, move forwards a bit, not too far. And then exhale, we'll move back. Oh, feel those thighs. Inhale, move forwards a bit. And exhale, move back. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, bend the right knee, move forwards. Feel those thighs, feel that left thigh and hip flexor. And exhale, move back. Okay, now let's come forwards and hold the pose. Inhale, move forwards with me again. And now stay here, exhale. And now let's take another smooth inhale. And now exhale, lunge a bit more deeply. Oh, feel those lovely muscles. Inhale again, please. And exhale, come out of the lunge. Now let's raise the left arm and bend the right knee. Inhale, bend the right knee, raise your left arm up. And now please stay here, exhale. And together let's inhale. Stay here, exhale, lunge a bit more deeply. And then stretch up as you inhale. And then please come out of the lunge, exhale. Oh, well done. Let's bring the right knee down and the left foot forward, second side. It's nice, huh? Hips, thighs, and that beautiful, beautiful, smooth breath. Left foot forwards now. And the warmth and the circulation. Oh, it's gonna be a good day today. So may we try now? Inhale, left knee bends, lunging forwards. Exhale back. And you can widen or lengthen the stance so you have a nice, solid, stable base. Inhale, lunge again, please. Look to feel that right thigh and hip flexor. Exhale back. Please don't strain your low back. Kind of move the torso forwards. Inhale, bring your shoulders in front of your hips, forwards. Exhale back. So you don't accrue tension in your low back. Let's do one more. Inhale forwards. And exhale back. Now we'll do the stay. Inhaling together, let's move forwards again. Beautiful. Stay here. Exhale. Please take another breath in. And now exhale with me, stretch a bit more deeply. And take another smooth breath in, please. And exhale, return to the starting position. Now the last one, adding the right arm. Inhale, bend your left knee, raise your right arm up. Oh yeah, stay there, exhale. Use your breathing to feel. Inhale again, please. Exhale, lunging a bit more deeply. Using the inhale to stretch up, inhale up. Exhale, moving out of the pose. And we'll bring the left knee down and pause. And again, in case there's any tension in the low back, let's take care of that right now. Chakravakasana, back on hands and knees. We'll inhale together. Exhale, hips to the heels. Oh, that's good. Let's do that one more time. Coming to the hands, breathing in. And then hips to the heels, breathing out. And let's just take another pause here for a breath. Just relaxing everything. Fingers, hands, wrists, arms, shoulders. I 
excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, let's lie down on the back. Let's practice bridge pose. So now we're really gonna feel those thighs and hip flexors. I think that the lunge prepares me nicely for this beautiful bridge pose. And could you please make sure you have a little bit of room behind you so we can raise both arms up and over to the floor behind us. So I'll just wait another breath here. Knees bent, feet or hip sockets with not too wide, toes pointing forwards, arms at our sides. Okay, let's begin. Dvipada Pitam. Inhale with me. Just raise the right arm as you lift your hips. Inhale, hips lift right arm up and over. As we exhale, let's lower the right arm down and also lower your upper back, mid back and low back. That's so good. I can feel that right shoulder. I can feel my back muscles. Let's alternate. Inhale now, left arm lifts up and over, hips lift. Feel your left shoulder. And then let's exhale, lower our left arm and upper mid and low back down. Oh, that feels so good. Now let's try both arms up, please. Inhale, lift hips and both arms up and over. Press into your feet, feel your thighs and glutes and hip flexors and shoulders. Exhale, lower your arms, upper mid and low back touches down. We'll do that one more time. The low back muscles. Inhale, lifting up again. And exhale, lowering down. We'll do it one more time. We'll hold the pose just for a little bit. Inhale, raise your arms, lift your hips up again. Inhale. And listen, when you exhale, just lower your arms down, please. Exhale, just lower your arms down. Keep your hips off the floor and interlock your fingers. Let's interlock lock the fingers, straightening the arms. Let's stay here three times, breathing in. Breathing out, not too strong. Feel your shoulders, arms, and wrists, all those beautiful muscles. Breathing in. Again, breathing out, feel your toes and feet and thighs and glutes. One more time, let's stay here, breathing in. And stay here, breathe out. And stay here, breathe in. Good, let's release the fingers and exhale, lower the upper back and mid back and low back to the floor. Oh, very good. Okay, next position, Appanasana. Again, just compensating the low back here. Let's lift the feet off the floor. We'll rest the hands on our knees. Let's take a smooth breath in together. Now let's exhale and bring the knees to the chest. Oh, feel that low back area stretching. Let's do four of them. Inhale, knees move away. Exhale, knees to the chest. Two more times, please. Inhale, knees move away. Can you feel your low back? That's nice, huh? Exhale, knees to the chest. Pull in your tummy, below the navel, behind the navel, and relax your shoulders. One more time, inhale, knees away. And then exhale, knees to the chest. Very, very nice. Now let's just hold the right knee. Hold your right knee with both hands, please. And straighten the left leg out to the floor. This will be twisting. Jatarapadevriti. As we hold the right knee, let's just take the right arm out to the side. So my left hand now is just holding the right knee. And we'll twist. So can we try it? Let's inhale first. And together... Just gently take the right knee to the left. Not too far, please. Just enough to feel your muscles, not very deep. Inhale, come back up. We'll do that three times in a row. Again, together, exhale, right knee across to the left. Just examine and feel. Hello, hip, hello, sacrum. Inhale, back to center, please. And exhale, right knee to the left. Good, inhale, back to center, please. And exhale, take the right knee across to the left. And let's stay here. Let's stay here for three breaths. Can we stay here? Breathe in. Exhale, we can twist a bit more deeply. Oh, yeah. Two more times. Let's stay here. Breathe in. I can feel my right hip. Sacrum. Exhale, tummy in. Look how the exhale helps us twist more deeply. Let's do that one more time. Stay here, please. Breathe in. And exhale. 
Very good. Let's come out of the twist on the inhale and just place the right foot on the floor and pause. I generally keep the right knee bent a little bit so I'm not straining the low back. Now I'll bring the left knee into the chest first and then I'll straighten the right leg. <laughs> so now I'm holding the left knee just with my right hand as I bring my left arm out to the side, twisting. Okay, let's see what happens here. Take a smooth breath in. And together, let's exhale gently, take the left knee across to the right. Feel that hip, feel that sacrum, not too far, please. Inhale, we'll come up. We did three in a row. Exhale, left knee to the right. Relax your left shoulder, left arm. Feel those lovely muscles. Again, please, inhale back up. Exhale, left knee to the right. Look how nice it is to move and breathe and just examine and feel our muscles. Inhale, back up, please, back to center. This side feels a bit tighter for me. Exhale, take the left knee to the right and we'll stay here for three breaths. Are you ready? Here we go. Let's take a smooth breath in. Exhale. Oh, feel that deep twist. Two more times, inhale. Exhale. Feel that left hip, low back, sacrum. One more time, inhale please. And exhale. Relax your left shoulder, left arm, left hand. Let's come out of the twist as we inhale now. And let's bring both knees, both knees up towards the chest. And let's try Sukta Padangushtasana. Please take your hands around the backs of your legs. With our inhale, let's raise our legs up to the sky, flexing the feet. Oh, that is so good. Exhale, knees bend, low back presses into the floor. And again, inhale, let's raise the legs up. You can slide your hands up to the calves. You can slide up, there we go. Exhale, knees bend, tummy in. Inhale, legs up. Now I'm gonna to try to touch my ankles a little bit stronger. Don't break off your legs. Again, exhale, knees bend, low back presses into the floor, tummy in. Let's inhale, raise the legs. Can we touch the toes? Can we stay here? Stay here, exhale. Good, stretch a bit more deeply, inhale. And bring the knees to the chest as you exhale. Let's do one more, raising the legs up. Inhale, I'll touch my toes. Good, stay here, exhale. Now try this, let's open the legs apart. Inhale, legs open, feel those inner thighs. Exhale, legs close. We'll do three in a row. Inhale, legs open. Sukta Prasadita Padasana. Can you feel those hamstrings and inner thighs? Exhale, legs close. Chin tuck. Inhale, legs open. Good, exhale, legs close. Last time. Inhale, legs open. But now listen, let's stay here. Stay here, exhale. Stretch a bit more deeply. Inhale. And let's bring the legs together. Okay. We'll give the knees a little bit of a hug into the chest. Feel the low back. Oh, yeah. Okay, how about sitting? Let's turn over and sit up. We'll practice a few seated positions. Very nice. Very nice. The first one will just be Paschimottanasana. So when I open and close the legs, just to protect the sacrum and the low back, let's do a forward fold, Paschimottanasana. And this one, let's just, uh, you know what? Let's bring the hands alongside of us. So we're starting in Dandasana. Let's stay here together, sitting up straight. We'll inhale. Don't go too far. Exhale, bring your torso forwards. You can slide your hands forwards. I can already feel my low back. Inhale, look up. And then exhale, fold just a bit further, pull in your tummy. Can you feel that low back, sacrum, hips, hamstrings, calves? Two more, inhale, look up. Exhale, fold, pull in your tummy. Avoid collapsing your chest excessively. Inhale, look up. And exhale, fold. Let's stay here one time, we'll inhale. Exhale, stretch just a bit more deeply, please. Good morning, good morning muscles. 
We'll slide the hands back up to sitting as we inhale. And stay here, exhale. Very nicely done. Now let's try Marichyasana. Let's bend the right knee. We'll bring the right foot on the floor. This will be Marichyasana Parivritti. So we did that inner thigh stretch. So we'll hear this, that inner thigh is nicely uh, stretched. We'll take the right hand behind us onto the floor and we're gonna bring that left arm across the right knee. So we're gonna be twisting to the right. That's beautiful, good form. Let's inhale first. With our exhale, let's look to the right, twisting. There's that hip and sacrum. Inhale, we'll just turn the head center. And exhale, we'll look to the right, twisting. That's nice. Let's do it one more time. Inhale, head center. And exhale, look to the right and twist. Can you feel that right hip? Now keep your head turned right. Stay here, breathe in. Stay here, breathe out. Uh oh, one more time. Stay here, breathe in. And breathe out. Now listen, as you inhale, let's glance across to the left. Inhale, we'll look left, look at your left toes. Now stay here, exhale, see if you can feel the right side of your neck. Again, don't be too forceful so there's no sharp pain. Stay here again, inhale. And exhale. And now let's simply come out of the twist and straighten the right leg. That's great. Like for me, I can feel the right side of my neck was stretched and my right hip was stretched. Let's do the other side, left foot on the floor. I'm gonna turn around just in case you need a model. <laughs> I'm gonna turn around and left knee bent. Now the left hand is behind me on the floor and the right arm goes around the knee. Again, don't be forceful, no sharp pain, no cramping, just simple, simple, simple. We'll inhale first, exhale, let's look left. I can feel that hip and sacrum already. Inhale, head center. Good, exhale, look left, pull in your tummy. Avoid collapsing your chest, try to sit up straight. Inhale, head center. Exhale, look left. One more time, inhale, head center. And exhale, look left. Now let's stay here. Let's stay here, let's breathe in. Exhale, we can twist a bit further, tummy in. One more time, let's stay here, breathe in. And exhale, twist. Now, with our inhale, can we glance over to the right? Look at the right foot, please. And be gentle, stay here, exhale. Try to feel the left side of your neck from the ear to the tip of the shoulder. Stay again, inhale. Twist to the left as you look to the right, exhale. Nicely done, we'll come out of the twist as we inhale and straighten both legs. We have one more. Let's try feet together, knees apart. So this will be Baddha Konasana. So this one's nice now because my hips and my sacrum and my inner thighs are pretty stretched. Now listen, don't take your legs behind your head. Just a simple, simple stretch. We'll sit up straight. Let's breathe in first. We'll come a bit forwards as we exhale. Look to feel your low back, sacrum, hips, inner thighs. We'll look up as we breathe in and fold as we breathe out. Relax your shoulders. Let's look up as we breathe in and fold as we breathe out. Remember, no sharp pain, don't overstretch. Let's stay here two times, breathing in. Exhale, we can stretch a bit more deeply. I can feel my hip, sacrum, inner thighs. Let's stay here one more time, breathing in, please. And breathing out. Well done. Let's come up. We'll straighten the legs and let's lie down on the back. Lie down on the back. And you know what? Let's bring the knees to the feet to the floor one more time. Just the feet to the floor. And because that's that was such a deep and strong forward fold, can we just lift the hips a little bit? So let's lift the hips off the floor. Inhale. And we'll lower the upper mid and low back down as we exhale. There we go, let's do that again. Just lifting the hips up, inhale, not too high. So this is the counter pose to that deep forward fold. Let's lower down as we exhale. One last time, just lifting the hips up as we inhale. Feel those feet and thighs. 
and lower down, exhale. And now, now we can rest. I'll straighten my legs and rest my arms at the sides with the palms turned up. Look how nice it is to spend this time together and just in a nice friendly manner, examine our muscles, deepen our breath threshold capacity and you know, feel our bodies. What a treat. Can I get you to wet your lips and relax your jaw a little bit, relax your facial muscles? Chin, jaw, cheeks, eyes, eyebrows, top of the head, back of the head. I hope you have lots of opportunities to smile today. Relax your facial muscles. Also, let's relax our shoulders and arms. Shoulders, upper arms, elbows, forearms, wrists, palms and fingers, our valuable fingers. Please take a moment to feel your torso, pectoral muscles, shoulder blades, rib cage, back, abdomen. Take a moment to feel your glutes and thighs too, please. Relax your glutes and thighs and hamstrings and knees. It's easy to feel, huh? Calves and shins and heels and feet and toes. I like how these exercises, they help me feel all parts of my body. We'll just rest for another 30 seconds or so. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. I hope we have a healthy, happy, productive day. Good morning. I'll begin to reawaken into my day. I'll wiggle my fingers and toes. I'll bend my knees and turn over onto one side. Look how nice it is now. Oh, my back feels great. My hips feel free. That's so nice. So thank you, thank you once again for spending some time and practicing yoga with me. I hope you feel a nice difference in your muscles and joints. I hope your breathing is nice and smooth and refined. How fortunate we are to be as healthy as we are on such a lovely day as today. So until next time, please stay healthy, happy, and well. Namaste, good morning.